Hello everyone and welcome back on my YouTube channel. So the next round of TTM is actually going to be in Hockenheim. A really cool track I think and of course I did one lap around Hockenheim again on the simulator in my GT3 car. So yeah go check it out it's been a good lap and now you know what to do and how to drive in a GT3 car around Hockenheim. Hockenheim a track I like quite a lot. Um, so yeah let's go for it. We have the main straight where you arrive, where you don't want to shift up to fifth gear and then you have a really quick right hander um, where you try to take everything from the left side curb actually um, and in third or fourth gear depending um, but yeah I was going a little bit too wide on the exit then you go to turn two where you break let's say before 100 meters actually um, in second gear try to take everything from the inside curb take rotate the car quite quick um, to then have a good exit for, for this long long straight afterwards which is of course easy flat with this left hander king going down to turn six which is um, a hairpin, a hairpin. <laughs> um, you arrive in six you shift down to first obviously um, hard and long braking zone um, ABS is hitting quite a lot there get the car rotated and then be on throttle as early as possible you have a right hander afterwards um, which is easy flat it's not even a corner and um, but still you try to take the, to leave to have to have the car on the right as much as possible to have a straight braking arriving in fifth gear shifting onto second um yeah then you have this right hand after which is just a kind of little lift um in a, in a gt3 car um then you have um yeah turn 12 which is a right hander in fourth gear and um, run everything on the extra curb which is different actually in real life um, fourth gear to second gear um, for this bank corner which is cool to drive and fun to drive um, then you have those small corner combinations which are flat but you have to need the, you need to have the car on the left side to be able to straight break uh, to break straight um, for the second last corner and then just run the speed bo through both corners and um, yeah take everything from the exit curb and that's one lap around Hockenheim. That's it that was one lap around Hockenheim so now you would actually know how to drive a GT3 car around that track um, and if you want to see us race next week then go check out the links up here where you can find all live timing and live streaming links and then here is a box with all timings for the race weekend, three practice sessions, qualifying and races and um, yeah cross your fingers for me and see you next week.